here we have um, one of the uh, natives here. <laughs> Are you from Little Italy in the Bronx? Here? I, I am. I do okay. live in the Bronx. You yeah. want to be in the video? Why okay. not? Here we are. Hey. What am I, Paisan? Well, no, I'm not Italian, though. No? I just okay. live in I'm not Italian area. either, but I grew up here. What's, so, your, what's your dog's name? Sushi. 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 Sushi made a new friend. Yes. Yeah. Hi, Hi, Sushi. She, she doesn't really care, you know. Yeah, cause she just, she's smart because yeah. a lot of dogs come here. Yeah. She's and really, some all of those them dogs. are very playful. Mm -hmm. And some of them, not so much. Yeah. But, you know, um, so she's been very happy categorizing all the I used smells. to walk a dog for a friend of mine here. It was a pit bull. He was very friendly, but he was a puller. Well, yeah, yeah, he wasn't a trained dog at all. Yeah. He wasn't even housebroken. Oh, that's horrible. Yeah, it was a, a pit bull. Yeah, it was it was horrible because I had to do the cleanup, and I'm not that type to do that kind of work. That's I not for you. me. <laughs> Well, you know, the, the thing well, is... Well, thank you for, for, for oh, being in the video. Bye, guys. She went back to say hi. She was yeah, here goodbye. in the middle. Or goodbye. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You want to say bye? She yeah. already did. Go say bye. We, we, we don't... We don't... We don't force it. Yeah. If it's there, it's there. You exactly. Know? Oh, she's loving it here. Oh, she... You know... A sounds, a lot of sounds. Yeah. So, you know what I noticed? My New York accent comes right back when I, I, <laughs> I thought I got rid of it. A lot of people pick up on it like I, when I don't even hear it. But when I come back to the Bronx in my neighborhood, it really comes back naturally. So, yep. So now we're walking to my buddies, my homeboys, pastry shop, Gino's Pastry, King of the Cannoli. So, we're making it to the corner of Arthur Avenue, which is well known as Little Italy, aka Little Italy. Full Moon Pizzeria is still there since I was a kid, still in the corner. Leave it. I had to reprimand her. Okay, so, all right, let's see what's up. Okay, so here we're crossing. Mr. Joe. What is this? Mr. Joseph Zini, Joseph Zini Place, Paul A. Victor, Honorable Way, Arthur Avenue, half, Full Moon Pizza. I would say Half Moon, I think. So I'm going to go to the Modern Supermarket before I go to the Gino's Pastries because I'm trying to find my papi. I've been hunting. I've been to three different stores already looking for El Morro. Um, Spanish coffee or not Spanish from Spain but Hispanic Latino coffee let's see if they have it here oh my goodness okay this is modern supermarket the second supermarket in Little Italy but the third in all that I've searched for Papi's El Morro coffee and it's not here so we just come out so anyways um now we're gonna hit Gino's Pastry Shop. So let me just say, Gino's Pastry Shop has been here for many, many years. And um, since I was a kid, probably before I was a kid, the son is the one in charge of it and now and with his wife. And I always call him Gino by accident, but his, his name is Jerome. So um, he's actually, you know, he's... Um, one of the head haunches around here, I would say, because he, he helps and he does all these events and stuff like that, uh, festivals, and um, he participates in a big way. And um, he, this is um, what I believe I've learned somewhere along the line. I can't remember where I heard it, but the, all this I'm saying is what I think I heard. Um, I can't remember too well because my brain is just like, poof. So, I remember something about the Bronx Zoo was about to close years ago something like that and he uh, was one of the people that helped re keep it open or he had something to do of some sort so here we are approaching I hope it's open I don't know why but it always seemed closer to the corner <laughs> than I'm seeing it is now my son came here Oh, they have a nice sign up now. I think it's a new sign. This looks big. 
Well, of course, everything is bigger and brighter nowadays. There goes the, the, the sign. And we are going in here. They even have sugar-free stuff. Yeah. Look at that. Yum, yum, yum. Biscotti. He makes everything here. Okay, so check this out. Look at this wall. So this wall are all these stars here. And um, all these people been here before. And that's how the, the, those pictures got up there. Is that right? All, all these people have been here before. That's what, yeah, see? Um, you never know who you're going to bump into here. And the thing about this shop, it's a very small shop, but it's very spacious. And what I love is when I come here, I feel like one of the family. I don't even feel like uh, through all, all the years. Yeah, she's shy. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So, so I'm excited. I'm going to have me a cup of coffee here. So, he makes the cannoli. That's the cannoli king himself right there, Jerome. He came out of the kitchen. Him and his wife do, do all of this. Run this place. That's his wife right there. Yeah. So here we go. We, we're still at Gino's Pastries, and this is a nice gentleman that uh, wants to talk to Sushi and me. And what's your name? Howard Humphrey. Yeah. Howard Humphrey. And he was very informative. He was talking about how uh, nursing homes never go to nursing homes. What a coincidence. 78 years old. 78? 78. And he had two hip operations. One on each side, right? Two operations. I'm only a total hip operation. Italiano? Italiano? Yeah. Yeah, Italian. I'm Italian. From where? I was born here. My oh. wife, I was born 25 years ago. Oh. I lived by myself. I got four daughters. Okay. You know? Okay. But, uh, my wife come from Italy. My father used to work over here. And I don't know if you remember Timmy Meat Market, the butcher place on the corner. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the where the live animals were? Is that there. what you're talking about, the livestock? Yeah, the butcher place. Where the pizza place is now? No. Right on the corner. No, that was Timmy's on the corner. Yeah, Timmy's, yeah. His Timmy's. father worked there. Okay. Yeah, your father worked there. Yeah. Wow. I worked for Frank Friend so long. Don't tell nobody. Don't tell anybody about this. <laughs> you want a box or you want it in a bag? Yeah. It's a secret. <laughs> it's on film. <laughs> All right, here's my coffee. A nice espresso. And I'm going to have a little teeny. Um, I've never tried those rainbow cookies and and the mini pistachio uh, cannoli. Pistachio and chocolate chip, you know, I did one on one, like the ends. So let me show you. This, this end is pistachio, this end is chocolate, and it's just a teeny, teeny weeny one. All right, bro. Take care, buddy. Good night. Thank you. Tutti o tavola a mangiare. Look at all the tutto delizioso pasticceria. And they supposed to have a outrageous recorder.